to build my thought on Jose's thought from yesterday, which was kind of amazing and kind of built to this incredible um, place. Um, but I had been thinking about it before, and, and he was talking about expected. So in the Christian tradition, this time before Christmas is called Advent. And that's the time we are in joyful anticipation. We're in joyful expectancy. And we are expecting something. And why are we so joyful? What is it that we're expecting? Well, if you're following the story, we're expecting the birth of Jesus. But what's so big about that? What's so big about that is that in the Christian tradition, Jesus is a symbol of our belovedness, of our connectedness to God and to one another, and is a symbol of birth, new birth. So each of us are born one day, and then we continue to be born again over and over, almost every day. I had a friend who died seven or eight years ago. Her name was Sister Peg Dolan. And she said, we are each a word of God spoken only once. And I thought about us being born, about Jesus being born, about us being born over and over. And I thought, oh, I'm a word of God spoken only once. What if I really lived into that? So I want to offer you, in the words of Jill Scott, um, live your life like it's golden because you are a word of God spoken only once. All right.